Now the Jimmy Garoppolo era has officially begun in, in Houston. It has ended in San Francisco and now it's coming to Houston. You know why? Because like I said earlier this week, Jack Easterby, Nick Casario, they want the people on the Texas that they do know. Bars, boom, drop the beat. But um, yeah, Garoppolo and Easterby, they have a relationship dating back to New England, okay? San Francisco 49ers, hey man, they're a quarterback away. A little bit better of a quarterback than, at least a little bit of a quarterback that's better than Jimmy Garoppolo. All right. Jimmy Garoppolo is going to be a Houston Texan. And guess what? Deshaun Watson is going to be a San Francisco 49er. I don't, I'm, I'm going to tell you something. The Texans are not going to get a huge draft haul for Deshaun Watson. You know why? Because you got Aaron Rodgers that's possibly going to be leaving Green Bay. Derek Carr probably going to be leaving Las, Las Vegas. Baker Mayfield probably is probably going to be traded from Cleveland. Okay, who else? Um, Ryan Tannehill might get moved. I mean, there's some other good quarterbacks out there, okay? And I'm not saying... Uh, I'll say outside, well, I'll say Aaron Rodgers is better than Deshaun Watson, okay? I'll say him and Derek, Derek Carr are kind of on the same level, but think about it. Are you going to give up a huge draft haul for Deshaun Watson with those 22 allegations against him? Or are you going to go ahead and say, you know what, if I'm going to give up a huge haul, it's either going to be for Derek Carr or I'm going to give up something lower than a huge haul and go get Derek Carr. You're going to go get Derek Carr, okay? Or you might go take a chance on Baker Mayfield, you know, or Jimmy Garoppolo. So, but I think the Houston Texans here, here's how they're going to sell this to our fan, to the fan base. They're going to say, well, man, Jimmy Garoppolo has a lot of playoff experience. He's a Super Bowl champion, won a Super Bowl with New England. You remember back up and, um, he made it to, they're going to say he led the San Francisco 49ers to a Super Bowl. He led them to a Super Bowl a couple years ago. And they're going to say he was this close from getting back to the Super Bowl. Okay. So that's, that's how they're going to spin it. So they're going to be like, this is worth more than any draft haul. So the Texans, what's going to happen is, and which if you're the San Francisco 49ers, you want Deshaun Watson, but here's the thing. All right. You still hold on to Trey Lance until you don't trade, trade, trade. You do not trade away Trey Lance unless you find out that the whole 22 allegations with Deshaun Watson, that has been resolved. But if it has not been resolved, but he can still play, which from my understanding, he could still play, even with those things, those incidents pending, okay? Well, you still hold on to Trey Lance, just in case if in the middle of the season, all of a sudden, the, thing, the situation don't get resolved, and then he, can, he cannot play. He's not suspended. But as far as we know, Roger Goodell has already said early in the season, Deshaun Watson is not suspended, right? Right? Yeah, right. So I think that's what's going to happen. They, the Texans, they're going to say, you know, this is better, bigger than a draft hall. You know, we got Jimmy Garoppolo. We know we got our quarterback of the future and stuff. You know, um, General Mills, he can learn from him. Davis Mills can learn from him. That's a nickname. General Mills, I don't know if it's going to stick. But, you know, that's, you know, that's what's going to happen. That's what's going to happen, people. I'm telling you, that's what's going to happen. But um, Deshaun Watson is going to be a San Francisco 49er. And guess what? Man, man, man. Yeah, they they're going to make it to the Super Bowl if that team stay healthy. Because Deshaun Watson, he fits that he fits that that offensive scheme that the Shanahan's run. Okay, I say the Shanahan's because Papa Shanahan, Mike Shanahan, and Kyle Shanahan, they run that same system, that Gary Kubiak system as well, okay? That that bootleg and stuff like that. I mean, he is more mobile than Jimmy Garoppolo and more accurate, can throw, has a stronger arm than Jimmy Garoppolo, okay? And he has that it factor, you know? So Dabo didn't refer to this man as the Michael Jordan of football for no reason, okay? So I think that's going to happen. Deshaun Watson is going to be in San Francisco, and Jimmy Garoppolo is going to be in H Town. Okay, as a Texans fan, I'm I, I I I'm numb to the expectations of the Texans of what they do. I'm numb to it right now. All right, but anyways, you know, I think that's going to happen. I think that's going to be a pretty good. That's going to be a pretty good deal for. It's going to be a good move for the Niners. I don't know what type of deal is going to be for the Texans. I mean, you know, it is what it is, right? But um. Share your thoughts in the comment section below and let me know. Do you think that it's possible? Share your thoughts in the comment section below and let me know. What do you think about a possible Jimmy Garoppolo trade going to the Houston Texans and Deshaun Watson going to the San Francisco 49ers? Do you think that'll make the Texans a better team with Jimmy Garoppolo there? Do you think that will make the Niners an even better team than what they are now with Desha if Deshaun Watson goes there? Share your thoughts in the comment section below. Once again, thank you all for tuning in to the Game Podcast. Peace out.